Hey everyone. Uh, oh, here's something I promised a little while back, uh, an updated version of how to make your shakes. Uh, if this is the first time you're getting this video, I want to say congratulations on helping out on my nutrition plan. I guarantee you this is going to be something amazing for you and what I'm here to do as your health coach is to make sure you get the results we talked about. I'm not here to dilly daddle about, hey, come get this. I want you to get where you want to go no matter how big or how small you think it is. Okay, so first off, I want to start off uh, with a couple things that we talked about. The first thing it, you got in your product is the the aloe. Okay, so what you want to do in terms of preparing this, okay, you're gonna have to forgive me because I'm not too comfortable in being in front of the camera. But anyways, you want to get about six ounces of water. So um, I'm probably gonna edit something in there, number six in there. So six ounces of water. Okay. And you should have a shaker cup, along a free shaker cup, uh, with the package, okay? And you want to get three capfuls of this, okay? So it's not too hard, okay? In the other video, I did a quick, a quick explanation of how to put it together, but I never showed it how it's done. And then boom. Once that's done, this is your first drink for breakfast, okay? You want to make sure you're always having your shakes in the morning, okay? Take it out, and then uh, get going on that. So I'm going to get started on this, and I'll be back in a second showing you how to make your tea. And an interesting t thing, too, is uh, if you want to add a little bit more flavor, or if you just don't have enough time, you can actually mix your aloe and your tea together. So you have a nice little sweet... Uh, caffeinated drink or if you really are out of time you can get add the aloe the tea and the shakes together I've done that before it has a nice nice little what do you call it chocolate sweet I have cookies and cream a uh, sweet taste with a tang in the end but yeah let me get started on this and I'll get back to you guys in a second all right uh, now that you're done making your aloe you want to get to making your tea next so what you want to do is you want to make sure, um, what I do to make things easier uh, is we have Steph's half teaspoon measurement. I don't know if you can see that on the screen, but yeah, this makes things easier having a, rather than trying to guess based off a teaspoon. But yeah, this is how we, what you want to do is you want to get another six ounces of water. Okay, and open this up. Okay, and... Uh, when I come, when I do this, there's a difference with when, it, when I come to scooping it. Okay, you want to, you see that? I don't know if you can, but you see there's a lot of extra. I always want to make sure it's even, because that, that that extra stuff is just not necessary. It just is an exact half teaspoon I want to try getting, so it's nice, like a nut. It's nice and even, in a sense. Okay, and I'll be showing more about uh, how you do your scoops when I get to making the shakes because I, I know my first time when I was doing it I'd get a good, huge scoopfuls and I wouldn't be leveling it out and I'd be and I'd be running out of the healthy meal and I'd be running out of the protein uh, the protein powder really quick so again I'm gonna get up get up on this that was nice and easy right so six ounces shake okay and then you're good to go here's the second meal second part of the meal Get your energy, get your metabolism going, especially if we don't exercise that much. We know how important it is to to get your metabolism up and going, and especially and uh, what do you call it, and start burning all that food. Okay, so getting up on this, I'll see you guys in a second. All right, now on to the main part of the meal, which is the healthy healthy meal and the protein powder, protein drink mix. So you. Uh, if you went with me to the club, you you probably got everything already uh, made for you, so you don't you probably don't know what they look like they, where they came from. So you, in the in the package, you get you get two of these. Okay, you have the healthy meal and you get the protein drink mix. This is the one that has the vitamins, nutrients, everything your body needs, and this is the protein where it follows up with a lot more of the vitamins, but also gives you everything you need in terms of the protein, which curbs your hunger and keeps your muscles growing. So in this whole process, you're not losing muscle, 
you're just cutting back the fat and everything that's terrible. So what you're gonna do, okay, for this one, you're not gonna see my face, you're gonna see me rough out when you do this. <laughs> okay, you're gonna get eight ounces of water, okay? If you want to, you can get up to 10 if you want. If you're really hungry, I normally put up to 10, okay? Eight ounces of water, put it in the little here, okay? I, I normally blend it, okay, because uh, the thing is with just putting it in water, uh, like as with, with every protein shake, there, it tends to be chunky, okay, this, t this goes with, uh, when I was doing it, doing other things, I did uh, muscle milk, I've done isopure, I've, didn't, I've done whey, they all tend to get chunky, including this, this is, even though it's, a, it's Herbalife, it's still it's still bound to the properties of being a protein shake so it, it ends up get, being chunky with just water so one of the reasons I blend it is it takes away the chunkiness and it, it comes out as a smoothie and who, lo who wouldn't want to have a smoothie in the morning so okay so on to this okay so for this okay the way I, I like to do this is something Stephanie taught me okay so see this little part I don't tear it all the way okay this is the protein. So get up here. Okay, and I'm gonna get a little get a little closer. You see how that is extra? So you always wanna level it out so you're not putting too much extra. Boom. See a nice even scoop now? And then put that in there. Okay, and if you took that out, that's all good. You can use your cap. The cap to even it out. So boom, you can use this, even it out over. Okay, because you don't you don't wanna be too, uh, I say generous with your shakes because you're gonna end up running out, and you want to maximize how uh, how much you have, especially really cut since you only have one of each or two of each, depending on which one. So the same thing with the the healthy meal. Yeah, I have I always get cookies and cream. This is my favorite of all time. And if you want to be a little crazy, you can get mix other flavors. Like what I've been doing is out over at the health club is I mix wild berry and cookies and cream to get strawberry shortcake. Okay, once that's done, okay, lock this up, boom, blend it with my ninja. Okay, serve it in here. You got your shake. Okay, in terms of how much ice you put, you can go crazy. It doesn't matter how much. I just the more ice you put, the more uh, the thicker it's going to be. And I generally, Steph and I like a thick, creamy, <laughs> thick and creamy um, shake. All right. And uh, lastly, once that's once you're done, I put this away somewhere. Oh, you have your cellulose. So it's important that you take this with every meal. So not just the shakes. But with the with the food you eat for breakfast, lunch, and dinner, this is what's gonna cut back on the water weight that your body retains and start getting you that tone look you want. So other than that, that's it. Congratulations on hopping on my nutrition plan. I'm excited for the results you're gonna get, and I want to remind you, even if even if this is your first time or just gonna be um, your second time seeing this, doesn't matter. Um, Keep going at it, stick with the plan because I know how you feel. It might be frustrating sometimes and that you m feel like you're not seeing anything, but trust me, people will. Uh, that's how I felt the first month or so until someone, uh, until I met up with my coach again and I got weighed in. So, uh, so I've been, if I've been trying to call you, uh, that's probably because I want to set up a schedule. Uh, schedule when I can meet up with you to weigh you in or I'm trying to see how everything is with you in terms of uh, how your energy is but it's my job as your health coach to make sure that you're you're feeling good about this process because we all know that it can get frustrating uh, frustrating trying to get there is trying to get to that goal so yeah uh, that's it if I if I ramble too much or if you don't if I didn't understand anything I'm saying Sorry, but yeah, I'll see you guys later. I'll talk to you soon. Peace.